hello guys welcome to shakes youtube channel um please subscribe to this channel so that you don't miss out any new video that we upload on this channel and give it a thumbs up if you like it share with your friends colleagues and family members and uh, also give a comment so that we improve or you suggest something that you think is necessary uh, to have on our channel today we're going to look at, uh, at a certain software which exists in microsoft office package and that one is called excel spreadsheets right office itself is a suit it has got several applications or several softwares and uh, today we're only going to look at um, excel there are several applications that exist in this package we have uh, office word we have um, excel we have powerpoint publisher access and so forth so today we are going to focus on excel so let's go to uh, let's go to first uh, definition of terms definition of terms we start with excel workbook Excel workbook itself is just a file and this file has got um, several sheets or several pages in it so I would like to say take a book a general book or a four book or a four ninety six page uh, counter book that's a, a general book or a literal book that you know what Excel workbook is more like a general or a literal book that you know but now what differs is that this uh, general book is now electronic and it has got uh, you can add more pages into it uh, unlike uh, in a physical hard, uh, hard book at a four uh, counter book where you cannot uh, add more pages you can add but naturally or normally we don't add pages so this one uh, is just a file that contains one or more worksheets to help you organize data that's a, an excel workbook now uh, let's look at um, spreadsheet or the sheet itself like i said an excel workbook looks like or functions like a general book that you know now when we say a spreadsheet it's now the pages inside the um, the sheets inside the book so it's a piece of paper in which data can be manipulated by the computer and uh, the data is stored in rows and columns it's in rows and columns what is it that you can use this excel workbook or excel sheets uh, what is it that you can use this for you can record and organize information in form of rows and columns you can perform calculations you can do simple statistical analysis across a row or a column you can create charts uh, uh, based on the data inside the excel spreadsheet so as i said earlier don't forget to give a comment if you have a question on uh, what we are discussing right now if you have a question uh, throw it on the comment section now let's look at um, how do we open this application how do we open this application there are several ways of opening Microsoft Excel application you may click on start button microsoft of uh, word microsoft um, start button and then you click on uh, all programs if you're using windows 7 or uh, anything before windows 7 then you click on uh, microsoft office package this one looks like a folder and then inside that folder you will find microsoft office excel depending on the version it might be excel 2007 excel 2010 2013 2016 
this is one method i will show you practically how we actually open excel and this is the other way you can click the start button and type excel you will see excel 2007 if you have excel 2007 installed or you will see excel 2010 2013 2016 depending on the version of office installed uh, on a machine so let's uh, go practical on how do we open excel so the first method let's say i say start and then these are all my programs i'm using windows 10 these are all programs and then i scroll down until i get microsoft office this is the version 2016 i'm using i'm using microsoft office 2016 then i click on the drop down arrow here yeah, i now see all these softwares that exist in this microsoft office package access all that all that all that all that but now i want to use excel so i will click that one that's one way of opening microsoft excel uh, application so that's opening it i can now uh, click on blank workbook so that i have opened i have created a new workbook with one sheet if i want to add more sheets i can click here to add more sheets here i can type whatever i want and then go to sheet number two you can see sheet number two has got nothing this is sheet number two sheet number one has got that one so that's how that's one way of opening uh, uh excel application and then the second way is uh to click clear start button and then without doing anything after clicking the windows uh, start menu or start button what you do is you start typing excel there you go excel 2016 if you're using 2013 or 2010 or 2007 it will say excel 2007 so here i click that one it's now opening excel so these are two ways of opening excel application so let me just close and we go back to our slide like right so these are the two i've illustrated how we can open ms excel application now how do you create a new webbook the first thing is the moment you open excel you have created a new workbook like i did previously in a few seconds ago i have indicated how you open excel and by opening that excel we have created a new workbook now uh, this is another way you may click on file or microsoft office button then you say new you give a name to the workbook or you can say control shift n and give it a name so let me show you this uh, practically let's open excel just that excel there is our excel All right so you see the moment i click on blank workbook i'm now creating a new workbook and it's saving this name so if i want to we will do that later so i have created a new workbook with only one sheet so i have one new workbook with only one sheet oh yes one spreadsheet so that's how we create a new workbook or i can say new and then create another new workbook blank it's now book two so these are the ways of creating a new workbook here are other questions that you may need clarity on how do you save your excel file i'm going to show you how do you rename an excel sheet how do you rename a workbook how do you open an existing workbook so let me show you how we do all these things so i have workbook one and workbook two right so what i want to do is i want to save uh, this book one i want to save it 
the first question was saying how do you save your excel file so i'm going to save this excel uh, file and i'm going to save it on um, desktop i'll just save it on desktop so here that's the desktop can i give it a name let me say um, intro to excel that's notebook one like that so that's the name i've uh, saved my file my excel file how do you rename excel sheet so this is excel sheet one and then i can have sheet two so what i do if i want to rename i right click on the sheet then click on rename i can say um my first sheet like that so that's what i can do and the same All right i can say second sheet like that i've uh, renamed my excel sheet and then how do you rename a workbook a workbook so this is a workbook with all these sheets sheet number one sheet number two uh, let me just say money choose uh, don't bother yourself copying what I'm doing here. I just want to show you that this sheet is different from this sheet. You see, if I open that one, you have this data, and then this one is having different information or different data. So, um, now I have this one, this is intro to Excel. I can save it as if I just say save, it will save everything in that workbook but now i can click and say save as then on desktop i can give it another name intro to excel maybe i can give it uh, to excel by shetsa just like that we now have the same uh, the same sheets or the same workbook given a different name so that's how we do we rename uh, our workbook how do you open an existing workbook you know we we, we 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 have this let me just close let me close this one this intro to excel by Shakespeare. let me close it and then open this one and then i want to open the one that i've closed so that's opening an existing excel workbook so i will say file and then open it might appear here because it's a, a recent workbook it's a recent file that I was working on, so I can go on desktop, then uh, open on the Excel sheet. This is the one, and then open just like that. So here we go. So that's how we do it. Um, so that's it for today. That's it for today. We have learned uh, how to open Excel application. We have learned how to create a new workbook. We have learned all these four things: how to open, how to save your Excel file, how do you rename an Excel sheet, how do you rename a workbook, how do you open an existing Excel workbook. Thank you very much for watching this video. Please uh, like, uh, leave a thumbs up, give it a thumbs up if you like this video. Leave a comment uh share with your friends colleagues and family members and don't forget to subscribe so that you don't miss out any new video that we upload on this channel goodbye